Hi, I'm Roop Mahajan, Chair Professor of Engineering and Director ICTAS, Institute for Critical Technology and Applied Science. I would like you to think of ICTAS as a home for interdisciplinary research where discovery and innovation are nurtured and as a meeting place of creative ideas for the 21st century. I want you to think of this institute as a laboratory, an open, inviting, and intellectually exciting laboratory where students and faculty members from different disciplines come together to exchange and develop fresh approaches in solving technological problems or to share their excitement on a new idea that is going to change the world as we know it, or perhaps just to ask a few questions of their fellow researchers on why does this happen anyway? Our new state-of-the-art facility, the NCFL, has been designed to provide just this kind of capability. This laboratory will provide access to researchers from academia and industry to state-of-the-art equipment like focused ion beam, transmission electron microscope, two-photon microscope, and others. With the inauguration of this laboratory in November 2007, we have successfully crossed the first milestone of the nano journey we embarked on a few years ago. We are marching ahead to meet our goal of harnessing the power of nanoscale science and engineering for enhancing human life in a sustainable manner. The NCFL is a facility operated by Virginia Tech's Institute for Critical Technology and Applied Science. It contains well over $10 million of research instrumentation in a specially designed building located here in the Corporate Research Center next to the Virginia Tech campus. Made possible by funding from Virginia's Commonwealth Research Initiative, the NCFL includes a broad suite of tools that facilitates research across disciplines. The NCFL's electron microscopes, surface probe microscopes, and spectrometers are supervised by a staff of scientists skilled in applying characterization tools to a variety of research problems. In addition to providing instrument access to qualified users, our scientific staff teach courses, train and mentor students, work with postdocs, assist small to mid-size R&D companies, and collaborate with researchers from other institutions. <laughs>